Hello, my name is Steve Faulkner. Welcome to Real Magic Review, and this is my review of Endless Cup by TCC. Before we do the review, the usual notices that are very important. Uh, one is like and subscribe, make sure you subscribe to it. Tell your friends, tell everybody. At the time of recording, I'm nearly at 10,000. Love to get up to there, that's a nice goal, isn't it? So you can help me do that uh, by making sure you subscribe, click the little bell icon so you are notified when I don't go, uh, when I can't do my live shows. And uh, that's important, right? Because every Thursday we have a live show at five. Sometimes I can't do it. You don't want to be turning up there and wasting your time. Um, I don't mean when I am there. I mean when I'm not there. Yeah. So do that. And do check out onlinemagic.co. Onlinemagic.co. Learn from a pro. See what I did there. That's my online magic course, 800 plus videos live. We had a really lovely live session last night. It was very funny, loads of fun. And, um, and those live sessions are uploaded as well. So loads of tutorials on all manner of magic and you can request things too, if you're a member. So this is, uh, when um, Roy Ma got in touch with me and said, would you be interested in doing this? I said, I'm not reviewing as much. I'm only reviewing stuff I'm genuinely interested in. Um, that I, I want to learn, that I think are beautiful or clever or whatever. And, uh, and then I saw this, I thought, yeah, go on, send us one. Because it's lovely. This is the Loter Bowl. All right? Now, the Loter Bowl, for those of you new to magic, is... Oh, it's not there, so I <laughs> fooled myself then. Um, lovely box, though, isn't it? You usually get a cup in it. <laughs> um, the Loter Bowl is the, the classic, you know, you show an uh, empty bowl of water, or you show a bowl of, bowl of water, empty it, and then it ref refills magically and then you keep emptying it and you can do that and then more water appears and that's a terrible explanation but that's the gist of it. Lovely, Jeff McBride does a lovely version of it. Loads of people have done it and it's great. Very, very magical. Anything with liquid is magical, isn't it? Because it, you can't hold, you know, you, you, when you make an object disappear or vanish, it's a slight of hand, but liquid, is, it's got that thing that, that really captures people as it captured me. I've never done the loads, but I've always liked the idea of it, but the prop itself didn't suit me, didn't suit what I was doing. And then this is here and I go, yeah, that's great. So this is, does the same thing, obviously on a smaller level sometimes, because these things are quite big. It's kind of close up parlor version of it. And importantly, it's shaped like a real coffee cup. And it does look like a coffee cup. You know, it's, it's, it feels like a coffee cup, kind of, but it's hand painted. It, it doesn't look like some weird thing. It looks like a cup you'd have coffee or tea in. And that's important if you're going to go this direction with it. Now, the thing with routines like this is, yeah, where do they fit? And that's why it's lovely that they've kind of marketed this, doing a version of kind of Rennie Levan's um, free breadcrumb trick with tissue paper or, you know, classically, slightly less, um, less nicely titled uh, Two in the arm, one in the pocket, <laughs> which is which is a different kind of thing. Well, same kind of thing, but slightly different presentation. But this, on the trailer, they show you doing it with tissue, which I think is very important because whenever you go and going to produce water, it's lovely that tissue paper's been in there. And that last production of water is very magical. It's great. Now, you don't have to do that with it. You can do loads of things. You could just have a glass of water, show it's empty, um, click your fingers, and it's full again. And you can also do that a number of times. There's a ways of kind of refilling this as you do with a loader bowl routine um, a few times, which is very easy. So that's the important thing. This is easy to do. Not necessarily the, the Rennie Levan routine, which has loads of subtleties, but the main effect, you can get a good effect to this with pretty much no skill, I would say, other than presentation, as I always uh, mention. So it's well made. It does what it says it does very well. We'll talk about the detail of that because a slight caveat to that, not that it doesn't do well, but it's something you're going to have to know about handling a bit. And there, there are loads of different presentations you can do with this. So I've got no real negatives about this. The only thing that you're going to have to know buying this is that even though it isn't difficult, it, you're going to have to spend some time kind of working with it. I think whenever you're working with liquid, you've got to make sure it doesn't get messy. And someone like me, it's really easy for me to do is get clumsy and forget about the details. So, you know, make sure you practice with it, even though it seems like you kind of don't have to. 
you have to kind of know, understand the workings of it and kind of understand what you can and can't do with it. And by the way, once it's set up, you can do more than you think. It's easy to be kind of too precious with it, but actually it's, it's quite hardy. I've turned it upside down, so you could do almost like a, a small one cup and ball routine with it with a final load and then a second final load being water, which I haven't done yet, but I have turned it upside down for quite a long time, kind of moved it around uh, and nothing has escaped, so to speak. The only other thing is that there's the way this works i'm not gonna give too much away is that it uses another thing that you get with it which is fine and when you run out of that you're going to be able to get someone but there's but again you're going to have to learn what you can and can't do with that my mistake when i set this up is again i was over precious with it i was so worried it wasn't going to work that i kind of wedged it in to place a bit too much and i couldn't do the thing i needed to do for it to it to work again none of this is difficult it's just one of those things you think i don't have to practice that that's easy but you you do and filling it up is easy not the most graceful thing in the world but it's very easy again you have to get used to doing that and once you've done it a few times you'll be able to do it very easily so i practiced the thing i like about this is because i went it's finally now Renly levan does a beautiful ending to the um, breadcrumbs routine the vanish which you can do but i like that i suppose it's my kind of cups and balls obsession is i like the idea of finishing with a kind of surprise so it feels like it's finished and it feels like it's had an ending he's Renny Levan's also got a lovely bit and Mia Yedid has a download on the free breadcrumbs but it's also on uh, Luis de Matos's maestro dvd of Renny Levan which is great I've just been watching it now I've watched the download and that it's all brilliant but he's got a thing when the where the spectator can put it in as well and that's lovely because they can put it in you're tipping it out these free breadcrumbs or or the paper or whatever you want to use and it's clearly dry and as you're doing it you can be wiping it like he does on the trailer i think that's a nice little subtlety as well it shows the, the sort of dryness of it and then the water is at the end i think it's, and it's made me go off and learn that routine and actually i think it's a beautiful routine i saw Rene levan performing that and it was just just great so i think it's a lovely prop uh, I can imagine someone doing this, a really lovely piece to music, it doesn't really fit me, I think I'm going to, I'm trying to find a presentation with it, which is why I haven't got any performance footage of it yet, uh, but I'm going to take it out close up, I want to do it close up, but it, it again, whenever you, I don't like working with liquid close up, because again, I'm clumsy, you could do, you could do it, take it up to your first or second, third table and do it once, but then the reset's going to take a little bit of time, or you can also do like, you can have real coffee in it, like coffee arrives, but I don't want to put coffee in it for some reason, it feels wrong, so that's that, uh, the links will be below. This was on, at the time of recording. This is on Kickstarter. Um, by the time you're watching it, it might be available not on Kickstarter. But I'll put all the links you need uh, below, and uh, highly recommended. That's how I'm going to finish my rout um, routine. <laughs> That's how I'm going to finish my <laughs> my review, flawlessly for one, and also with a very original thing to say. Highly recommended. Go and have a look at onlinemagic.co. Like and subscribe. Thank you for TCC for sending it me. It's lovely. Bye.